Hello everyone, this is Brady with Lewis Motor Company and today we're taking a look at our 2008 Ford F-350 utility bucket truck. This has a 34 foot working height, 29 foot platform height, Versa lift unit on it. The truck itself has 137,000 miles on a Triton 5.4 liter V8 gasoline engine. That starts right up, sounds great. You can hear that now. It has an automatic transmission. It's got a fiberglass utility box. Just an overall nice truck and mostly original truck. We didn't do hardly any paint work to this thing. Just some minor touching up. And came in a nice running and driving truck. Engine sounds healthy. It goes down the road as it should. Transmission shifts through all the gears as it should. So this has an Cummins Onan gasoline generator, which operates the boom. The boom runs off of a PTO. So that's really nice because you can actually shut down your engine and just run solely off of the generator. Keep your engine hours nice and low. Robert's gonna open our utility boxes here and get up in the boom. We'll check out the truck. We've got some minor dings, dents, scratches, scrapes, things like that on this truck cab. Uh, but like I said, it's mostly original, so we kept it that way. Got good tires all the way around. These front tires look to be at 75%, if I had to guess. Frame underside all shows pretty nice. Got some light surface rust in some areas. Kind of typical Maryland type stuff. We don't get a whole lot of snow here. Hear that generator start right up. It's a very quiet gasoline generator. It starts right up. But you can see underneath, got some light surface rust, but like I said, in Maryland here, we don't deal with a whole lot of snow. Just some light stuff. The cab corners and underside rocker panels are all very solid. Take a look at the interior while our buddy Robert's going high in the sky there. Now this is just a regular work truck. So you got crank windows, you got a cloth seat and a vinyl floor. Cloth seat looks like it's seen better days. It's been stitched up here. Got some minor tears. Little console there, makeshift console. But the floor is a nice black color. Jump up inside here. We've got 136,557 miles at the time of this video. No lights on the dash. It's just got the brake light on because the parking brake is set to operate the boom. But a very quiet and smooth engine. AM, FM, radio, heat, air conditioning. Got some auxiliary switches. That's our master switch for our boom. Got an integrated trailer brake controller. Cigarette lighter off to the left. But this interior shows nice. You can see the floor is a nice black color. Got some wear and tear on the dashboard. Uh, but no major damage. Headliners in nice condition. Some minor stains. Robert is utilizing all of the boom here. So that's a 30 foot, four foot working height, 29 foot platform height, and it operates as it should. Very smooth operating bucket. A very, very common boom. We'll check, take a look inside these utility boxes. Again, this is a fiberglass utility box, so you don't have to worry about any rust. Uh, at least on the utility box. We've got some 120 volt outlets. There is a, looks like a converter there. Um, so that generator also has, uh, you're able to utilize some power from it as well at the rear of the vehicle. But inside these boxes, you see a little bit of wear showing, but overall very nice. Got some dividers in here as well. So you could use, uh, is for tools or storage. Good tires all the way around though. See here, deep tread made. These rears look to be brand new. Or close to it. Inside, these bins show really nice. Again, Robert is going around town, operating it as it should. This thing operates really nice. It does have a trailer hitch off the back. It's just a regular pinnel hitch. And it says a 3,000 pound trailer weight. So if you wanted to pull like a splice trailer or anything like that, it could be done, as long as it's at 3,000 pounds. Seven way blade wiring. I'm looking underneath, it's got some light surface rust, but overall this thing's in nice shape. 
There's our Cummins Onan generator up there, just working away. We'll jump up inside and show you that. There's our switch panel for our lower controls. Now this generator is showing 78 hours. Uh, that's what it's saying, but uh, it's hard to really believe that unless they just didn't use this, which we've seen before. I can hear that thing very quiet. You know, I'm talking over this thing. Uh, it's a very quiet generator and it is powering this boom for us right now as well as uh, some other stuff on this body. The boom's functioning as it should. Robert is high in the sky there. But in between the boxes here, it's got a rubberized black hood which is really nice. And overall, it's just, just a nicely well sorted bucket utility truck. Those bucket trucks are super hard to find. We've had a long dry streak of bucket trucks. We, uh, we haven't had many of them, but this one is probably the first one in a, at least a single stage in a couple, probably a couple months, honestly. It's been a long time to try to find a good bucket truck, but this one definitely seems like a pretty nice bucket truck. It runs and drives well. It operates as it should. You can see we're going around town here with this boom. Generator starts right up. The boom operates as it should from both the upper and lower controls. It's got a good utility box on it. I do like that it's a fiberglass utility box take a look on this side but it shows really nice inside and out these boxes up here go all the way through to the other side again good tires all the way around in fact I believe we did replace these these look brand hammer new these drive tires back here see that but again the frame underside all is in nice condition nice black color on the frame exactly what you want to see in a used vehicle uh, of this age showing really nice rocker panel showed nice now you do have some minor scrapes scratches dings dents this is uh, just kind of normal wear and pulling the decals off things like that now, Robert's gonna tuck away our boom solid operate there but this is just a nice looking truck it's a smooth truck goes down the road nicely it's two-wheel drive so um, it's a pretty nice ride to it thing sits low to the ground and good tires up front here don't think we replaced these however they are in good condition with deep treasure baiting but you can hear that five four it sounds good don't Manifold leaking or anything like that it starts right up and it sounds great. Very smooth, powerful engine. Looks like Robert's on the sticks from the lower controls now. Look underneath this engine real quick. It sounds really healthy, and with those miles, this thing's just getting started. But you saw it operate, you heard it run, runs and drives well. It's a nice little truck. It's definitely a nice little bucket truck. Super hard to find a good bucket truck right now in today's market. And I have a feeling this one's gonna get sold pretty quickly. Got an aggressive price on this thing and it's here to be sold. But you can check this truck out for sale on eBay. Feel free to give me a call, shoot me a message. I'd be happy to help you. I can ship this truck throughout the United States. Call me and I'll give you a quote on that. We are Lewis Motor Company. We're located in Clarksville, Maryland, which is just outside of Baltimore, Maryland. You can find us on our website at lewistrucks.com, L-E-W-I-S, trucks with an S, dot com. Got our information on there as well as some other trucks and our phone numbers on there as well. So let's give me a call and let's get this thing sold. Thank you guys for watching.